Where can you find a healthy antibiotics free chicken rice in Malaysia? Come with me to find out. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're exploring a healthy chicken focus shop that has three outlets in Malaysia. Let's go. So we are checking out Beacon's Chicken that has a outlet in KL Gateway Mall at Bangsa South, one in Plaza 33 Petaling Jaya, and one more that is in KLCC at the heart of Kuala Lumpur. So the story behind the start of this Beacon Chicken restaurant is that the owner is actually from the Beacon hospital that's why you hear a lot of like beacon chicken beacon mart and they started this beacon chicken it's basically he saw that there was a lot of cancer patients they actually cannot eat chicken that has antibiotics or hormones that is being injected to the chicken with this he created a chance for cancer patients to actually be able to have a hundred percent hormone free antibiotics free no chemical stuff basically healthy normal eating chickens I'm really sorry to any vegetarians or vegans that's watching this. Yeah, so it's definitely non-vegetarian vegan friendly. So for the Muslim friends for this place, there is a halal certified for their chicken products. So it is all halal ingredients. So this outlet, the one that I'm visiting, it is at KL Gateway Mall at Bangsa South. Bangsa South or KL Gateway Mall basically is a place that is more lively on the weekdays because of the office crowd. I arrived here on the weekend. Uh, it's more like an office area so it can be a little bit quiet plus it was 2 p.m when i had this meal right so back to more information about beacon's chicken so they also operate beacon's mart that started first so they have a lot of outlet on beacon's mart where you can actually purchase all this antibiotics free hormones free chicken i'm not sure what if it's free range or not they have about like seven or eight about seven of um farms uh, that is in Johor at Tangkat Johor which is south of Malaysia next to Singapore so the farms are there and they have uh, probably like a warehouse in Petaling Jaya where they pack all the chicken and kind of stuff so here I'm also showing you all this uh, stuff that they have they have also essence chicken essence and these are all the chains of their beacon mark which is a lot so you have to google to see where their outlet is or you can pause this video and then you'll see where their outlet is it's like what like 20 30 outlets so you can see they have information about their chicken is being fed with like seaweed herbs chrysanthemum moringa leaves all the healthy stuff okay time to talk about the food the soy sauce chicken rice was one of a kind the right balance of salty and sweetness normally for chicken rice meal you either have your chicken roasted or steamed white chicken but soy sauce chicken this is the first i'm seeing this would i say the chicken rice here is better than singapore's famous chicken rice of course yep everything that they serve is made fresh in-house like this chili chicken rice chili it's really really delicious and so is their ginger sauce these two are a must try and it's hard to get it right also for their rice do you know that it's been cooked for four hours which is longer than how a rice is normally cooked which you normally only need one hour because they're using a lot of spices to make this rice like over eight types of spices yep so you have to order the steamed white chicken this is the classic chicken rice which is the Hainanese chicken rice where you know if you go to Singapore normally people will say it's theirs but hey Malaysia does it better especially for vegans restaurant there's also chicken wontons in the soup because this is a Muslim friendly place as Normally the wontons are either pork meat or prawn meat. Chicken meat wontons are quite rare I think. Look at how juicy and healthy the chicken is. Yeah, so it's all fed using organic products. No chemicals is involved. The buttermilk chicken is also absolutely delicious. It's all worth a try. It's fried chicken breast cubes coated with some delicious creamy butter sauce which is usually sometimes they don't it either too sweet or it's too salty. Normally it's too sweet but this one it's perfect balance the butter sauce goes really well with the white rice you see it's also topped with a beautiful omega egg you won't regret trying this i also have good things to say about their pumpkin chicken porridge and what makes this special is that it has chicken essence in it normally chicken essence is expensive because it is extremely healthy they even have chicken essence for sale which it will usually cost a lot more if you just have the chicken essence by itself so this you can get in the pumpkin porridge which is the right texture texture of the rice you know the consistency of the porridge the pricing is super affordable and this is also very flavorful it's healthy flavorful what more can i ask for you can have this for either breakfast lunch or dinner
winner. It's healthy and tasty. The curry laksa is also another winner. I know I've been saying good things about all the food so far recently because it has all been really really tasty. And this curry laksa falls into the list of a must try when you visit here. So it has fried onions, hard boiled egg, cucumbers, chicken meat, prawns, uh, tofu, chili, and some bean sprouts. Wow, it has everything. The only thing is that this can be kind of spicy, so if you can't take spicy, you have been warned. But you can also have it with this satisfying Hainanese te, which is like milk tea, but a strong tea flavor with a right balance of milk. It is not too sweet like how I like it. It's hard for me to explain, but if you like milk tea, you have to try this. The other drink worth trying here is the Hainanese kop. Whenever they mention Hainanese, it's always the kop. Be, the te and also the chicken rice all these three are worth a try it has a very classic chinese coffee taste so good if you want something refreshing then it will be the ice lime water so overall we really enjoy the food here i only have good things of everything that we ate yeah so this soy sauce chicken is made using the lakam ke chicken which is quite a reputable malaysian singapore soy sauce brand i only have good things to say about this place so feel free to drop by if you can and let me know your thoughts on the food so thanks for watching if you'd like to see more food hunt videos like this please like and subscribe and hit that notification bell